but I'm actually pretty disgusted because they actually don't do turkey anymore. So all that waiting for a car breath still not to get turkey. Turn down for what? What's going on guys? Welcome to today's vlog. It is Saturday and we are just about to head out and hit the park. Everybody's here with us today. Oscar Alfred, Porsche, Vanellope, Sarah. So we're going to head over to a couple of parks today, nip and get them something to eat, take the drone out with me and I'm also going to be shooting a 360 video today. Time to get back to basics. Time to start normal family vlogging. It's resuming right now. So we're going to get this official Our Family vlog started. So guys, we just arrived at the park that we came to with Rebecca last week, maybe. Can't quite remember now. It was only about a week ago anyway. So we just come back to this one because the kids were saying, can we go back to that park? And then around. we were going to we were gonna go to the Pound Bakery, but I'm not too sure whether it's actually going to be closed now. What are you doing, playing football first? Yeah, should we go in this? So the boys have brought a football today so they can have a game of football and then there's like oh we should have bought bats and balls and we could have played what do you call it I really like it badminton i love badminton my favorite sport i'm not too is it open son you might have to go in that way you might be locked no. it's locked it's got a big pad block on it yeah. look you see this? I think it's That's a padlock. That means you can't get in this way. Get in. So you're going to have to go the other way. I'm going on that part. There's a big padlock on it. And he's still trying to open it. So we've just come back here so they can have a little go on this part. And. I don't know what Vanellope is doing, she's just running around, she wants to go and play football. I'm going to go and see what the... Vanellope, do you want to come on here with Mummy? Yeah, I want to go on that. Come on then. Okay. So we're just going to go on here. The day's all lovely. I know you've seen me in last night's vlog with this dress on, but I've actually got two. I actually got these dresses when I was pregnant with Vanellope. So, that's why I've got another one on today, because it just feels so comfortable. Oh, let's get going in this park.
just left that park simply because there was like about 15 lads came on it so when they were just acting like idiots and just taking over the kids stuff this is at why things end up broken it just really does my head in because it's quite a decent park to be honest so we've decided we're going to go to mcdonald's because i'm absolutely starving may as well eat out sa saturday and sunday considering about out monday tuesday and first friday um so we're going to go there and then we're going to go to alexandra park which you've seen in previous vlogs because i just really like that park it just it's one of them parks that just brightens up your day because it's just nice and fresh and beautiful so that's where we're going to go and then not too sure what we're doing then but you'll know because you'll be with us anyway will you we just came into the shelter and we decided that we weren't going to have McDonald's because it's a little bit unhealthy and we decided to go for the healthy, healthy option and go for a car bread that we wanted. But I'm actually pretty disgusted because they actually don't do turkey anymore. So all that waiting for a car bread is still not to get turkey. So I'm not, I'm not impressed. <coughs> but I'm going to show you what I got. Even though we have actually started to do food, it looks delicious. Check this out. A full half leg of chicken, stuffing, a Yorkshire pudding, like, and all the trimmings, and then mash. Seriously, you can't beat it. The kids have just got um, like pizza baguettes and chips and what else in here? Oh no, you got burger and your push got burger and Dave just got car for it also. So we're going to tuck into this and then we're not going to have pudding here. We're actually going to go and get some strawberries, bananas and cream and do that at home. And cream. So we're going to go and enjoy this and get extra chubby. So the kids have just got their dinner. So I'm going to show you what the kids have got. It looks pretty nice actually. So what have you got, boy? Pizza, Pizza. and chips. I have pizza, I don't want them. What did you get, darling? What did you get, son? Same as Oscar. What did you get? Same as Oscar and Alpha. Alright guys, we're back now. The kids are in bed. Um, I just wanted to go over a bit, really, about the, the place where we had the car for we spoke to the manager at the end and it weren't their fault. Basically, Sarah's been craving this turkey roast dinner, haven't you? For months and weeks. And since, since basically since she was pregnant, and what's happened is we went in, we finally went into the carvery place because we were going to go to McDonald's and we didn't. We went to the Sheldon Arms in, in Ashton. When we got in there, Sarah clocked that they weren't turkey. What they were doing now was rotisserie style chickens. So it's like half a chicken that you got on your plate. So I got half a chicken, Sarah did, but she was pretty annoyed that she didn't get the turkey. So we spoke to the manager and said, look, they've changed the menu, which they have, and it's absolutely dire, isn't it? Yeah. It's it, the, the, it's just gone completely downhill. Re it really has. And she's had loads of, loads of comments about it. And you know what? Bless her, the manager. It weren't her fault. She came over, she spoke to us. And I mean, the service in there is pretty... It was all right, but they messed up all the puddings and they gave us the puddings for free, but they were already messed up and they messed up the drinks, but that wasn't her fault. That was a new member of staff, which spoke to us. No, it weren't his. It was the first chef. girl that, yeah, and the chef, because they were, they were bringing out like a Sunday, and it was the same Sunday, but it was different. So they put like chocolate sauce at the bottom of one of them and none on the other. And you know what kids are like? Why have you got that and I've not got that? So that was a bit of a shame, but she said in December, there the turkey's gonna be gonna be back but i mean she ain't gonna wait till um december I'll go to a different she wants one so we're gonna try a toby carvery this time i had to obviously whenever i go and have a big breakfast i send it to henry from the um the henems i don't know what his channel name's called now he changed it all the time it was chicken fam or something like that or chicken house i don't know what it was called but anyway i always send it to him i sent him the sunday dinner because his wife emily is um he's vegan at the minute um and i keep trying to get him to feed and meat because she's looking ill henry she's looking really poorly i mean anybody would do who's eating cardboard and um pulses that? and stuff like that i'm only joking but I, I always send like the big food like that to to henry so everybody's been asking about 
the situation with the office space, stuff like that. I'll let you know tomorrow when Daz comes round, because Daz and Naomi are coming round to the house tomorrow night. We were going to be going for a curry, but I don't think we'll be going for a curry, so we'll probably do something here, but they want to come round anyway and see the kids. Um, they've got some Turkish sweets, apparently. Okay. So we might do a live for the kids, and they can all do a Turkish taste test with Daz and Naomi, because <clears throat> when Daz and Naomi come round, it's always fun, isn't it? All the time. We've missed them as well. Sarah's missed Naomi a ton. So the kids are upstairs now. They're in, in bed. Vanellope's downstairs asleep with Portia. Sarah is over here on the couch, just doing what she always does. Leaves everything to me. They're cleaning everything so. else. I've just been washing. ordered to make a cup of tea as well, so I'm gonna have to go in the kitchen now Sarah's and make a cup of tea. Downstairs, doing all the washing, doing the Ubering, doing the cleaning. And I also had a very interesting phone call conversation earlier this evening, but more on that tomorrow because uh, somebody's actually come to me and said that they've got it wrong. It was, they've got the wrong end of the stick when it was to do with me. And I'm not the person that they've been told I am or I'm not the way that they think I am. So I can't fault that person for coming to me and speaking to me about that. But again, more on that tomorrow when we go live. Uh, I don't know when we're going to go live, but when we go live, we'll we'll tell you about it. If you haven't already heard about it before then, which I'm probably assuming you might have done, if you're wondering what it is, you'll see tomorrow. Um, if you've been following the channel for the last 48 hours, you'll probably understand what it is. I'm sure of that. So at the minute, this printer over here is printing a glue stick holder. These are the glue sticks that we use for some of the 3D printers, but today, I received this from Amazon. This is basically the updated bed for this printer, the Ender 3. So now that doesn't require any glue sticks to stick any prints to its bed. So this, this is basically a, a dispenser that goes on the wall. So it'll go on your wall, you put your glue sticks in it, so you can go over, pick one off, use it, put it back in. Just like a battery dispenser really. So I'm gonna make me and Sarah a cup of tea and then we're gonna end today's vlog. And I might go and buy some wallpaper tomorrow. And she might go and buy some wallpaper tomorrow. Because I've not decorated this living room for two years. Because she's not decorated this living room for two years. Oh yeah. I might even paint the living room grey tomorrow. Oh yeah. See, this is what you have to put up with when you have kids after kids after kids because she's constantly nest building. But anyway, I need to make a cup of tea. All right, guys, back downstairs now. Just about to go to bed. Thought I'd end today's vlog. Thanks, everybody, for checking out today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Tomorrow, the boys are back. Well, Mason's back. Liam's still at his dad's at the minute. We'll speak more about Liam probably next week. I think Sarah's going to do a video on it, aren't you? So she'll talk more about Liam then and uh, why he's at his dad's at the minute and what's going on with school and college and his... Um, apprenticeship and stuff like that. So Mason's back tomorrow. So what we're going to try and do is we're going to set him up with some GoPros on the chest. And we're going to do the laser tag. We're also going to be live after this as well with Daz and Naomi, as we said. Um, yeah, that's basically what's going to be going on tomorrow. I'm going to try and crack on with the website that we've got coming out, and then obviously once it's done, I'll announce it to everybody. Um, I'm going to try and get some Lego done as well because I haven't built any Lego since. Seriously, I haven't built any Lego ever since Christmas. No, you could do it polishing. Last actually. year, I have not done Lego and my Lego collection is looking slightly deflated at the minute. So I've got a Star Destroyer that's got like a wing section left on it to build. Then I've got the Millennium Falcon, the Kessel Run Edition. And then I've got a few tinier sets like battle packs and stuff like that to build. They're pretty cool because you've got some cool stormtroopers in them. So that's what I'm going to try and do tomorrow. Will it go to plan? Probably not because it never goes to plan when there's anything to do with me and Sarah. But the thought's there anyway, so that's all that matters. So on that Lego bombshell I am going to end today. Do not forget to smash the like button. Subscribe if you're not already. Make sure you leave a comment. Make sure you click the notification bell. It does nothing and we will see you guys tomorrow because we do this every single day. <laughs>